The 48th Wanita MCA Annual General Meeting on Saturday unanimously passed seven resolutions covering party affairs, the economy, religion, agriculture, food security, laws and institutional reforms. The resolutions were approved by 940 delegates after being debated by 12 delegates from 10 states, with some of them asking the government to provide incentives to reduce the burden on employers whose employees go on maternity leave for 98 days. They also urged MCA to be more active in recruiting members among the youth and to boost the participation rate of women in politics, including those from professional groups. Meanwhile, the 59 MCA Youth Annual General Meeting, which also took place on Saturday, passed nine resolutions covering party and youth affairs, the economy, government affairs and education. After 11 delegates from nine states engaged in a debate session, 390 delegates passed the resolutions, which include wanting the government to continue addressing economic challenges, to take steps to reduce the rising living costs, to reinstate the goods and services tax GST at the rate of 4%, as well as improving the secondary school syllabus by introducing election topics to allow students to be more knowledgeable about Undi 18 and the democratic process in general.